Well, Lauren, what did you think, first of all, of today uh, at the 3200 here in Riverton? I was super surprised, you know, for a really quick turnaround between the Classic yesterday and this 32. I was really happy to go 920. I have no complaints at all. What about the quick turnaround from today's 3200 to the, the 1600 medley? <laughs> yeah, a bit of, bit of strength work there. We're kind of peaking right now with intensity and before we hit taper going into regionals and states. So it definitely wasn't fun, but I mean... And I was tired, but it was a good split still. So, and uh, what were your thoughts about the track classic in Casper? I mean, the the, the, the amount of the the amount of competition and your time there too. Yeah, the classic's super cool. I'm very uh, grateful that they brought it back this year. I hope they continue doing that in the future. And because I think a lot of the athletes were really interested in the format of the meet. It was run really well, and the recognition that a lot of these elite athletes get there, they really deserve. They work hard year round, and of course, the best part's been able to compete with the Wyoming guys at the Classic and see who's the top dog in the events, which is really fun. Do you have time goals this year for the events you're in? Yeah, I do. Uh, going into state, I want to get Peter's state record, which is 918. I was just two seconds off that today. So with a bit of tapering, I think I can definitely achieve that. And uh, I'd like to go around 415 in the mile. That may be a bit ambitious, but we'll see at BYU this weekend what I can do. How did you get started in distance running? Uh, well. I, I've always been passionate about sports, but I've never been really good at anything. Never been super coordinated or strong or athletic. Uh, luckily, distance running, if you really get out what you put in, and uh, I'm luckily pretty naturally disciplined and stuff, so I just decided to try distance running, and it fitted me well.